What? Reaction. I don't understand. <laughs> oh, excuse my accent. I say reaction. But <clears throat> auction. Auction. <laughs> <laughs> auction. Auction. Read all about it. Action, nigga. <laughs> Action. <laughs> Fraction. Action. Do. <sighs> I don't wanna. <laughs> he isn't ready. You could do an intro. <laughs> I'm just gonna laugh. <laughs> you could. <laughs> All right, guys. We have YJ Pony Boy here, and he has a deck prop fall. 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 Fuck. Uh. Ready? Mhm. Mm All right, guys. YJ Pony Boy here, and he's doing a deck profile for us. So tell us, what are you giving us for today? I'm profiling you X Sabers. Um, I wanted to profile it earlier around the time of Nats because, like, right as right after Nats, I wanted to profile it, but I didn't get the chance to because I had won a win a mat with it. Uh, this is the mat right here, so that's pretty cool. I beat Sylvan's round one, and then my opponent didn't show up round two because he was watching the duel between Yugi and Astral. And then I beat Girgia last round, so it was pretty cool. So yeah, this is the deck, deck Sabers. Three Fultrol. One Bogart Knight. Three Full Helm Knight. Three Emmer's Blade. Three Dark Soul. One air bellum, two postual, and that's the end of the monsters. Play Book of Moon, Enemy Controller, Dark Hole, Mind Control, Forbidden Lance, two Soul Charge. Uh, this is one of the reasons I cut down to one Bogart Knight. Three Pot of Duality. I play three Emergency Call now. That's the second reason that I cut down to one Bogart. Two Saber Hole. This card's incredible. Well, one Reinforced Truth. Three Wiretap to make sure that your Hunley plays get in there. Uh, Torrential Tribute. Bottomless. Compulse. Warning. And Breakthrough Skill. And that is the main deck. <laughs> Broken. Okay. Okay, okay. Okay. <laughs> uh, for the extra deck, I play one Photon Strike Bouncer. I think it's the best control uh, rank six there is. And this deck plays as a control deck. So, yep. I play one Soul Silver Mountain. It's really good to lock down spells and traps because you have no spell and trap removal. Uh, you just have the negation with Fire Tap, and you have um, this. This is the one thing that you get. You get this, and you get Hunley, and those are the only two ways you can stop back row, pretty much. Play one Mech Whip Engineer. It's good to uh, make it after you make a Fall Troll, and just like keep your Fall Troll on the field as long as you want. Uh, one Gotham's. This is what I think like makes the deck good now, because you get to soul charge uh, and make big Gotham's plays and just take out every card in your opponent's hand, which is really strong. And so you clear the back row, then you drop the Gotham's, and then you get rid of their hands. Really nice. Play two Hunley. You know, play <laughs> one Soza. Uh, I. I mean, even though I cut down to one Bogart Knight, he's still really good uh, to kill things that can't be destroyed by battle, to get over anything, period. So, yeah. I uh, play one Black Rose. It's just a combo of Mind Control and Enemy Controller. I th still think it's a strong card to have in here. Uh, one Colossal Fighter. Uh, he can get huge because a lot of your deck is Warriors, so he can just become a huge problem. Play one Scrap Dragon, you know, just generic removal. 
play one Crimson Blader for my hard matchups, like Sylvans and um, anything that's fast. Just I, my whole goal is to slow them down. So this guy's a huge player in those matchups. Goyo Guardian, because he came back and he's a boss. He's really good. He's the strongest level six you can make. He's the strongest guy, like pretty much in the action deck. <laughs> Uh, Barkeon Beast. These guys are amazing. Just control. And last one is Armides. Because he's the best level 5 synchro. So yeah, that's the deck. Some of the things that I didn't have in before were... Uh... Wait. Shit. Uh, When I did the Winamat, I wasn't playing Forbidden Lance. I wasn't playing Goya, of course, because it wasn't legal. Um, I was playing, I think, Fiendish Chain. So I was playing uh, a lot of different cards. I wasn't playing 3 Duality. I was playing 2. But right now, I think what I have is really solid. I'm still considering playing 2 Burgart Knight for when you have Dead Hands, which happens a lot. But right now it's working well. Uh, I'm really enjoying playing the deck. And I'm going to play it for a while. Just because Goyo's out. Just because I want to make Goyo. I want to use a deck that can make Goyo. So yeah, that's the deck, guys. Uh, no side deck, but um, it's pretty much just standard stuff. I haven't been to a, a tournament in a little while, so I don't really know what's going to go into my side deck yet. So yeah. All right, guys, that was Why Is Your Pony Boy. Well, before we go, I have a few questions. Why don't you play uh, Tanky or Rhoda? I remember back in the day when I used to play Rhoda. The thing is, you don't... Like, the extra spell and trap, uh, you know, they're like, oh, let's say I'm playing, you know, three full hum knight. If I played a Rhoda, I'd be playing four full hum knight. But I don't think Full Home Knight's that important of a card right now, so I don't feel the need to search it. And Poshul, you pretty much never want to draw because you want to be able to summon it off of Reinforced Truth. So, that's why I don't play Rhoda. And Tanky? And Tanky, <laughs> uh, <laughs> the only thing that you can search with it is Bogart Knight. And uh, as you can see, I cut down to one Bogart Knight, so... I just don't think Bogart Knight's that useful because you have so many ways to get monsters out of the graveyard. Let's say you have, you know, instead of having a three card combo, like, let's say, Bogart Knight, Fall Troll, and a Tuner, you have a two card combo, which is Fall Troll and Soul Charge. So I just think that's infinitely better. And also... I bumped up to three emergency call, so that just makes getting out Fortral a lot easier. And the card that I usually search for the most, unless I need something else, is Fortral. When I don't need anything, I just search Fortral, just because I don't want to draw it, and because there's always opportunities to drop him. Hmm. Well, that was a great insight into the mind of why your point we're playing his X Saber deck, his beloved, beloved X Saber deck. Thank you for your deck profile, and you know, guys, remember, as usual, like, comment, subscribe to this video, and you might see why Joe Ponyboy more around here. And you know, as usual, guys, we'll catch you later.